hello welcome back from the festive season today i'm going to show you how to create html and css files and also how to link them together so i've created a folder on my computer called html and css for beginners and um, i have opened this folder in vs code as you can see it's absolutely empty so to create an html file in vs code you're going to right click press new file and then write the file name we may call it index dot since it's an html file we shall call it dot html and that is how you create a html file then to create a css file you right click create a new file and we can call it styles dot css now that is way one the second way you can simply just click on this icon which stands for new file and you can create another file called .html so basically this is how you can create html and css files in vs code now how do you link the two files so let me delete this about right click and delete move to recycle bin so we are going to deal with these two files index.html so in index.html let's create html structure by pressing shift exclamation mark and then press enter so it will create html structure so i'm gonna put h1 here and call it welcome to my page so this is an html file so i can open this with live server and here is the page this is how it looks now to write css there are three ways we can write css external css internal css and inline css so for example inline css so i'll write a comment here inline css this is the type of css written within the element for example i'll go inside my h1 and i'll write style and give it color red so we expect this color to be red so when i go back to check you can see it is red that is inline css internal css we write css just below the body we shall create style and then we shall call the h1 either by class or tag so for now let's use the tag which is h1 and then we can give it a css property maybe background color we give it blue so this is what we call internal css so when i go back you can see the background color is blue and then lastly external css this is where we create a separate css file and then link it to the html document so to do that we go below the title let me write this external css we shall use the link tag and then we call the css file that we created which is styles.css and link it there so once it's there we can come here in styles.css for example I'm going to create another element here and I'm going to call it h2 and I put some content and that is what we see this is my portfolio so to style this we can give it an ID selectors pick an item for example we have an ID selector we can give it an ID of heading so for IDs we shall go to CSS IDs are called with hash and then heading and then we can give it font size 500 and then font weight bold then we give it color chocolate you can see that this is how you write external css with what we call id selector so let's see how we can use a class selector so i'm gonna go to my index.html i'll create a div element and i'll give it a class call it wrapper and inside that i'll create h2 call it about me and then i'll create a paragraph with an item so let's now style the class wrapper so i'll copy the class name and go to my css class selector start with a dot so i'll put my dot there and my class name then i'll give it a height of 50 pixels i'll give it of border one pixels solid blue so increase the height to 80 percent then we can give it border radius two pixels and that is how you use class selectors so thank you so much this video was basically 
how you can create HTML files via VS Code and CSS files via VS Code, and then how to write CSS and link to your code. I hope it was helpful. Thank you for watching.